You may have viewed my previous video using Lemmy Shine and a cement mixer. It worked well and produced some very good looking brass. This was the generally accepted recipe I used back then. This is the new recipe that I'm now running with. The recipe remains unchanged, however you need to increase the amount of dishwasher magic to a half a teaspoon. And here's why. I had a conversation with a chemist and he informed me that the active ingredient to clean reloading brass is citric acid and he suggested three different products. I tried cleaning some reloading brass using Lemmy Shine, pure citric acid, and dishwasher magic. As it turns out, an eighth of a teaspoon of dishwasher magic wasn't enough. However, I found when I quadrupled the amount of dishwasher magic, I got the clear and distinct winner. I think we can all agree from the outside it all looks good, but I had to have a way to distinguish between them. What I did was, for each batch of brass, I painstakingly looked down the case neck, what I call looking into the ears. I set my standards extremely high, and even if I saw the slightest imperfection, I put that casing in the blemished pile. The results somewhat surprised me, but going from left to right, Lemmy Shine finished second with 60% clean. Citric acid fared last at only 50% clean. Dishwasher Magic finished first with 80% clean. In short, as a previous advocate of using Lemmy Shine, this discovery has made me change my way of thinking, and I'm upgrading to Dishwasher Magic. If you are new to wet washing your reloading brass, here's the procedure. To a tumbler of your choice, the recipe is add 4 pounds of brass, 5 pounds of stainless steel pellet pins, enough water to cover the mix, a half a teaspoon of dishwasher magic, and a small squirt of Dawn dishwashing liquid. Seal the container and tumble wash for an hour. Normally the brass remains in the tumbler while I rinse it clean, but I wanted to show you just how black the water gets. Here I'm emptying the contents into a media separator, rinsing it if necessary, and spinning it to isolate the brass. Now lay this brass out flat to dry and it'll be ready for reloading. Check in the ears, check in the primer pockets if you deprimed, and tell me if that's not the most gorgeous brass you've ever seen cleaned and polished. Some more good news. Dishwasher Magic can be found at Walmart in the same aisle as Lemmy Shine and it costs less than three and a half dollars a bottle. I'd like to acknowledge Marshall and give him some credit for the technical content within this video. Without his ideas, expertise, and research, videos like this would not be possible. Thanks again, Marshall, from all of us, the American Reloader.